Welcome back to Ligari, everyone. We got another great video. Super fun, super simple. You're gonna learn it all right here, Ligari.com. All right, so what we're doing here is just doing another thin coat. You might need to do this if you're going over a dark counter and trying to do a light, light color counter. You can kind of see how the edges didn't cover all the way, but once you hit this edge, it'll completely cover it and make it look like a, a solid blue surface. So whatever counter color you're doing, always, always make sure your front edges are, are nice and pigmented well. The top isn't as critical up here just because it's going on a lot thicker. The, the corners right here and your faces, you wanna make sure those are, are really good and pigmented. You kinda of see the difference from, from one coat and then two coats. Covers, covers perfectly. This is only for, like I said, a light counter over dark counter or a dark counter over light counter. And we send out enough pigment, enough primer in your kit to where you can do two thin coats or, or at least do two coats on your front edge. And we only waited about 20 minutes and we're already priming over it again. The primer dries really, really fast. We, we designed the product to do that. That way there's not a lot of wait time. You can do everything in one day. I wanna show you how simple our kits are to install. So I'm gonna do this whole counter right here with just using my hands. I'm gonna spread it with my hands. I'm gonna blend the colors with my hands. We might spray some dispersing effects on it, but everything will be done with my hands. No rollers, no paint brushes, no squeegees, nothing. So I'm just gonna keep, I'm gonna do it the same as we always do though, pour it down the middle. My hands are already gonna get mucked out. I'm just gonna scoop this out of the bucket. Get every last drop here. This is gonna show you guys how awesome our products are, how user-friendly they are, and how you don't have to be a professional to install it. You just gotta, gotta buy our kits, that's it. I'm gonna let that drip out a little. Now I'm just gonna start spreading this around. Keeping it away from the edges. If spots strip off, I'll pull them back. Now we're gonna be adding a lot of highlights to this, so this ain't gonna be as thick of a coat as it typically would. And I've never, I've never done this with my hands, so. Pretty cool, you guys are gonna see the first one. Actually feels pretty cool. So I know I got I got a little, little more over on this side. So I'll just start kind of bringing it around. Like I said, guys, this is a, a not as thick as you typically would do your base coat because I'm adding a lot of orange, a lot of orange gold, and a lot of white. So once we get that on here, it's gonna make it really thick. Gonna run the edges now. This will make sure all the material flows over nice and evenly. I'd like you guys to try this with any other product out there because it's not even out there and it's gonna self-level and become perfectly flat. Not a lot of products will do that. All right, now I'm just gonna 
kind of swirl it like I would with a roller. Do that, kind of hit my edges. All right, so now we're gonna add the highlights. Like I said, guys, I'm doing this with, all with my hand. But, I mean, come on. What's going on here? Is this thing even gonna turn out? Yeah, it's gonna turn out. It's gonna look amazing. And I told you guys, we're doing a lot of, a lot of this orange gold, didn't I? Well, now you can see. I wanna make sure I got some right on the edges. That way it'll continuously flow over like this. See how that's flowing over? Well, if I don't have enough product, if that keeps flowing, there's not gonna be any orange there to pull. So I wanna add, add some orange back there. That way we're gonna for sure have some orange flow over there. Same thing there, right here, right here. Okay, there's that. Now we're gonna do white. Do the same thing with white. I'm trying to get it where the orange isn't. And guys, when you're doing edges, it's all about getting, getting enough material so when it keeps flowing over, it, it pulls the same material, the same color. That way it looks like a, a cutout slab. All right, so now I'm gonna blend it, and I'm just gonna just gonna smear this stuff around, guys. Simple. No, no technique at all. Hit my edges. Again, this is with my hands. No rollers, nothing. can even do our 3D technique using your hand. But look at that, just see how they're flowing over all awesome. It's gonna look really good. All right, so we're gonna add some dispersing effects using our, this black, using our black mixed in uh, isopropyl alcohol. I'm not gonna hit everywhere. Just kinda gotta do it random and we're gonna come through with white also. White, the white will hit everywhere. Make sure I hit my faces. Now I'm gonna take my white. This is our snow white. I'm gonna do the same thing here. So I'm gonna kinda spritz it all. Beautiful, guys. So after you guys spray the dispersing effects, if the epoxy's too thin in spots, it can fish eye. So that's fine, it's not an issue. All you gotta do is just pat it in, that's it. And it's just because it's a thin spot, it's, it's separating the, it's breaking the plane of the surface. Um, got a little one right here. But yeah, it's really simple. So don't, if you have those, just get your gloves on, go through and pat pat the holes in. It's really simple, but can you tell where these bubbles were, where, I, where we just did that? You can't. There's so much going on in this counter. And it just looks phenomenal. So like we always tell you, over the next hour to two hours, you wanna scrape the bottom drip. See how it's dripping off. It's a little runny right now to do it, but I'm just gonna do it to show you. Normally you would use a paint stick, but we're using, we're doing this whole counter with our, with uh, my hand and a glove. So this is all you would do with the paint stick. And like I said, you're gonna wanna do this again, probably in the next half hour, 45 minutes. And eventually it'll get so sticky that it doesn't drip anymore and you got a nice flat edge. Thanks for watching everyone. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Comment below. 
share the video, help us get the word out. This product is amazing and it's changing the countertop and flooring industry. Also, make sure your notifications are turned on. That way you get notified every time we post a new video. Follow us on our social media sites too, Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest. We're always posting customer installs there and you can see what people are doing with our products. It's truly amazing. Our systems are one of a kind every time. And remember, Ligari.com has you covered.